Natalie, two more events to go from the diving well. What are we going to see? Andrew Harness, the junior from Texas, is set up well entering tonight. He got second in this event last year. And I want to talk about his third round dive in the prelims. His reverse two and a half. He actually received a 10 on this dive that you're about to see. His coach, Matt Scoggin, telling me his rip is better than ever. And Harness is appreciative of the opportunity. Tons of points. It all comes down to this, the big stage, the bright lights and a little bit higher up in the air than you see on the springboards. You see the three different levels of the platform, the five, the seven, and the 10 meter. The men can choose which level of the platform that they feel most comfortable to compete on. Of course, the 10 meter, the tallest one, is the one that you see in the Olympic Games. So if you want to prepare for the Olympics, you can only have your five or six dives off of the 10 meter platform. But these eight men tonight, they'll be doing six total dives, one in each direction, a forward, a back, a reverse, an inward, a twister, and a handstand dive. Cover doing a lot of his dives on the 10 meter. You can see he's marking his hurdle for his forward three and a half. Beautiful, keeps his head up on the start, knows exactly where to come out. He's seeing his spots. A back two and a half on the five meter. That's a 3.0 degree of difficulty. He hits it well, getting seven and a half and eights. Nods his head, yep, I'm good with that. nice control at the top of that arm stand exactly what the judges are looking for he'll get sevens on that dive and Loriaga with the famous rip he'll finish the dive to the best of his ability presses up into a tuck to the top of the arm stand holds it for over three seconds gets a nice push See, he stands up so tall on the end of the platform, keeping his chin and his chest up. He sees his spots, lines it up. See that jump off the end with his head up, knows exactly where this dive is. He could do it with his eyes closed. He could do it in his sleep. Nicely done. I know Cover has been focusing on platform. He's been trying to perfect these dives off 10 meter and it shows. He received a 10 on this dive in the prelims. <laughs> Basically a mirror image of the dive he did in prelims. He gets eight and a halfs and nines. His back and his reverse category off platform are his money dives. I wasn't lying. <laughs> he just continues to drill these two groups. In diving, in these type of competitions, it's all about who can consistently do all their dives well, but the back and reverse categories tend to give people some difficulty. So if you can hit those, you'll be in contention. Beautiful from start to finish, his top to the rip on the bottom, the TCU crowd, going crazy, you see some nines. He's even clapping. Strong jump, keeps his head in, pikes out, disappears in the water. That's what you want to see. Doing a handstand, he's setting up his hands so he can get his shoulders over.
excellent control at the top of that handstand. Just fabulous. Pushes up, holds it nicely at the top, engages his core. Then pushes off the platform, gets into the pike, squares out. Excellent dive. Carla's liking it too. Harness like a dart going in the water. What a great finish for Andrew Harness after getting second on the Big 12 platform last year. He wins it this year, his first title on the men's platform. Done with such grace and composure. Andrew, an emotional win on three meter. You turn around and you get the title again on platform. What has been key for you? Um, honestly, it's been uh, really important just to stay, you know, really in the zone, um, control my breathing. That's been huge with all the adrenaline um, pumping through my body, especially during that three meter event. Uh, it's just been really important to control my, my, uh, you know, uh, my mind and just try to do my best and happy with the result. This past year being an Olympic year, you competed in the Olympic trials. How did that help you? Um, just having the uh, Olympic trials experience was really, uh, it was really a good experience to have because, you know, get to compete against the best guys in the country. I get to be exposed to different techniques of diving, different coaching styles. Um, I think it really helps to just see what's out there and uh, carry it into my own diving. NCAA zones, then NCAAs. What are your goals, Andrew? Uh, I'd really like to a final on platform. It's been my strongest board for I don't know how long since I started diving, I guess. And uh, hopefully a or b final on springboard as well, and hope that you know help win that NCAA title for the team. Andrew Harness earns two back-to-back -back Big 12 titles. Congratulations, Andrew. Thank you.